Welcome back to your live continuing coverage of CES 2015 on Be Terrific. I'm Michael Arces. We're also syndicating on Planet5D.com, the best, baddest, and biggest, most informative DSLR blog in the entire world. It's taken over photography. Hopefully you like the last segment, Planet 5 Deers, on the Loom Cube. That's a really great tool for you photographers. And of course, we're on ExtremeKids.com and all sorts of other syndication partners. Wherever you're watching, wherever you're watching, however you're watching, thank you so much for watching, for giving us your time. Don't forget to tap a friend on the shoulder and say, hey, this content is pretty cool. Check it out. BeTerrific.com slash live. You can get involved in the chat, the IRC chat. And don't forget also to download our app, app.beterrific.com. Send your photos to us on our hashtag cubes on set. That is Instagram. Upload them to Instagram and send the hashtag be terrific TV stage. At the end of the week, we'll pick a, the best photograph that we like. Just crack us up or do something, inspire us, and we'll give you a hashtag cube. It's a wireless digital photo frame that's amazing. And that will be yours. We also have a think tank photo bag to give out. We'll tell you about that in just a little while. I'm so excited about our next guest. I mean, first of all, they're awesome. We were talking off camera, but I am excited about them. They are on the forefront of technology and home automation. They are bringing it all together. They're integrating everything. It's Insteon. This is Joe, that's Joe. It couldn't get easier than that. You guys are Insteon, and it is unbelievable. I've got the starter kit at home. I'm going to do a tech review for all our viewers. I got it a day before CES, and my wife was like, don't even think about setting it up. She's like, don't make everybody's life miserable. No, she's excited about it. She's like, wait till you get home. And she, I was like, no, 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 no. I, and you're right, honey, and she is right. She's amazing, she's the best woman ever, and so, well, I but think, I, I think can't she, wait to rip it open. I think she made a great call advising yeah. you to do it. Uh, wait until after you get back. Right. Um, the best part will be after you get it going, because what happens is people start with easy things, a couple of plug-in lamps or something like that, and then they start realizing, well, I've got other applications in the home. Uh, one of the challenges in our industry is, well, what, what do I need? And it's hard to imagine until you've lived it. Once you've lived with it, you never go back. I mean, that's so true. Um, you know, I've been very familiar with home automation systems for a very long time. For this is what I've always said, is there are a lot of great home automation systems out there. They're all all the way up here. And you have to have an installer come in, and it's not really for the masses. You guys are bringing it to the masses. Absolutely. You're making it accessible for everybody, and affordable, and easy to use. I don't have to call an installer and go, hey, uh, this isn't working, could you program that? And accessible from anywhere. Yeah. How did you guys come up with Insteon? So, we started the business 23 years did ago. You really? Yeah. Wow. We founded and still own smarthome.com. Okay. So we've always been a consumer first That's that's a pretty good domain name. Not bad. <laughs> and so our focus is on uh, meeting the end user's uh, goals, making it user installable, and now a retail is really our biggest channel. So we're in thousands of retail outlets, including Walmart and Best Buy, Sears, Home Depot, et cetera. And so our products are, are made for the everyday consumer. They average $40, so they're, they're very affordable and we work very hard to make sure that they install easy and work every time. So what I think is great is that your products, you have a starter kit, I can buy more of your products, wall plugs, thermostats, all sorts of stuff, and add to it as I go, right? I, I like this now, but I can add that later, and add as technology grows yep. um, and changes. But in addition to that, if I already bought a Nest thermostat, or I already bought a, a, an Echo Bee, or I already got somebody else's thing, it will work with that, and it will integrate all that together. Can you guys tell me how you how you managed to make all that work, and how you managed to get the handshake going and the the marriage working? Well, we're we're, we're thrilled to uh, to be working with the folks at Nest, mm -hmm. uh, announcing that uh, we're not only part of the Works with Nest program, but we're also with the Russia Our Rewards program. So they announced that at the show. We're a partner. We bring our 200 devices to them just like we do with our announcement about HomeKit. So at, we announced, uh, I think it was a couple days ago, our, uh, I guess the world's first ever view of the HomeKit application uh, that we're releasing that will not only work with our products, but will work with the other HomeKit products. Uh, and the, the world's first ever view of our hub. So our HomeKit is Apple's new uh, iOS 8 uh, enabled 
home. You know, they've got uh, the health kit, and they've got the home kit, and they've got the car kit. Those yes. are the new things. And so that's integrating your uh, phone into your car, integrating your phone into your health, integrating your phone into your home. You guys are dealing with home. And it also can work for business as well. Sure. Absolutely. Which, I mean, think about how many times there are small business owners out there. Oh my God, did I turn the thermostat down? Right. Oh, I got to run to the office, honey. Oh my God, can I look at the security cameras? I got to be home with my computer to do that. Yes. Oh my God, I didn't set the alarm. Or Joe left the office and didn't set the alarm. Joe two, you're Joe one, he's Joe two. Joe two can set it for you. Yeah, we've worked really hard to make sure our products can reach as far as possible into uh, numerous applications. So we know of uh, buildings up to three quarters of a million square feet that automate the facility on, using our products. Uh, there's, a, there's an embassy in Washington, D.C. that does their entire grounds, all the lighting and irrigation with Insteon. That's so amazing. You'll never, you'll never- their irrigation? Like, yeah, you, yes. you, you won't hit a ceiling with Insteon. It scales unbelievable. All right, talk about some of the things it does. I didn't know it did irrigation. If you can control it or sense it in a, in a house or a building, you know, we got we you covered. It. 200 products. So well, uh, irrigation. Give me a couple that. Uh, uh, give me, okay, we know lights. We know television. Control, okay, screens, that's what I'm saying. Give me window some. Screens give me or, some that are some that are, are more obscure that people would be like, wow. We can dim fluorescent fixtures. Fluorescent fixtures. Yes. We, Is that even has that ever been possible before? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's it's been possible. It's been yeah. possible, but okay. it's usually been the domain of super high end, expensive commercial uh, systems. Okay. We said, well, we can do it. And Excellent. so now for 100 bucks, you can dim a fluorescent fixture how, in your office building. How hard is it to motorize the drapes in my house? Because uh, I never close them correctly. Um, most of the uh, today's window drapery uh, systems are very easy to install, and they're wireless. Okay. And, and unless they're really big, you can use batteries. So it's just a matter of taking some good measurements and, and uh, getting a screwdriver out. All right, I got, I got to talk to uh, Peter at my building about that. He's, he's got to take the measurements and hook that up. I, yeah. I, I'm not screwing anything in. I'm, I can plug in the thing. I can do all that. I can do all the tech on the back end. How easy is it to set this up? I mean, obviously, we're going to do a full tech review, and we're going to find out. But how easy is it to really set up? So most of our products um, pair by pressing and holding a button until you hear a double beep, and then you press and hold the other button until it double beeps, and they're paired. And the app will actually walk you through it. If you want to set up and add devices to your home on the app, you basically just say, I want to add a device. You tap on the icon that looks like the product you're adding, and it walks you right through it. You know, the, the Heritage Strategy guys on Long Island are watching right now, and they're they're saying that they love the Insteon stuff. Ah, awesome. Oh, yeah. great, we love them. Yeah, hey, what's up, what's up Heritage Strategy guys? <laughs> The, uh, they're, they're an amazing organization, Heritage Strategies on Long Island. Uh, I actually know those guys and they're all watching. They got the whole office watching and uh, they, they are loving this content. Yeah, it, what, what's fun is we've been around for a while. Yeah. We've got millions and millions of nodes in the field. So we, we, we have friends and, and you know even at trade shows like this where you spend most of the time talking to the press or business partners, it's fabulous to hear, to have customers come in and, and they're just excited you know, to kind of touch, touch base with us. Hear their and, stories. And, and, and they've yeah. all got unique stories, and, and there are people who have thousands of nodes in their on their house or property. How, how, or what is the what is the most where you've been like, wow, I didn't know you you, you somebody would use it in that way. Like, what is, where have you been blown away? Probably the two biggest uh, installations would be, and, and we don't even hear about all of our installations. We've got about two thousand dealers across the country. They buy from us and they do with the products as they see fit. So we only hear about it if they tell us about right, it. Right, but what, I mean, an embassy. You've heard. Yeah, I mean Ho the irrigation is pretty hockey crazy. Hockey rinks. Hockey rinks. I'm a hockey guy. Yeah. So okay. you know, I, I know my buddy Jeremy Taubes is watching, and he's a hockey guy too. Yeah. So, so what are we doing at hockey rinks? Uh, energy conservation. So making sure that loads are only on when they should be on. Okay. Partnering with uh, utilities. So the rush hour rewards program that uh, we're working on with Nest. Uh, uh, for a discount on your bill every month on your electric bill, um, they get the right to maybe turn off a water heater for a short time during peak demand periods. And and what about in, in, in hockey rinks, like uh, you can get a more even ice surface maybe by, by, by having all this stuff I think you're together. above my pay grade now. <laughs> I don't know, I'm trying to figure it out, I don't know. I think it's mainly not having any lighting loads on um, and or the uh, air conditioning loads on unless it's wise. Right, well I guess that's what I'm saying. It's, it's like optimizing it's the temperature. It's optimizing yeah. the temperature which is keeping the ice surface yes. at the right uh, thickness. I mean it's really important, you don't realize like bad ice is really bad to play on, it's really slow. Mm. And then the puck doesn't move and your feet yeah, don't move no and fun. it's like skating in quicksand. <laughs> oh, it sounds bad. Yeah, so you want good ice. 
I like hard ice. You know, you don't want soft ice. All right. Okay. So <laughs> now, now I'm just. I'm. You guys are like bobbleheads. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Whatever. Uh, I get it. Um, that's pretty cool though. So ice rinks. I would have never guessed that. But I also just thought of one. How about trade shows? Like I leave my booth at night. If I'm the guy down there, I want to turn my lights off, or, or I want to, you know, get something going before I get into the booth, or you know, checking on the booth, or even you know, the nanny cams, or you know, putting a security cam on the booth. We we have found our products over the years just in trade show booths. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I know people use them. It, it's really up to you to find applications. People find, you know, uh, Christmas tree lights. How many times you know did I watch my mom <laughs> climb under you know crawl under a Christmas tree to unplug it, right? You could just go. And now you just hit a little remote you know grab wow. your phone and turn off. Works the with Android, device. iOS, any other systems Windows, out there? Windows, Kindle, yeah. it does Mac work with Kindle, desktop, cool. Windows desktop, 20, browsers. Twenty three years ago, you started this company. Everybody must have told you you were bonkers, right? Well, you know what's interesting? Uh, we feel like a twenty three year old startup mm -hmm. um, because the industry has always seemed like it was almost there. Uh, even the analysts in the industry are saying, well, three years from now, there'll be you know, so many billions of devices. What's exciting about it is it's actually happening now. So we, we started way too early, you know, <laughs> wouldn't do it again, <laughs> but um, it's given us the opportunity to really get it right. Yeah. Because uh, it takes a while to, to build out an ecosystem of 200 products and get it right, it, it, it's, it's a lot of effort. Yes, absolutely, smarthome.com. As, a, as well as lots of retailers. What a great, but what a great domain. Smarthome.com, of course, tons of retailers. You guys are awesome. Give people an idea of the starter kit, how much that is. How much is that retail? They're right about $100 for the, for the, the lowest level starter yep. kit. You basically get the internet hub mm -hmm. for free, uh, and then a couple of modules, and then our biggest uh, starter kits are in the two $300 range. You'll get a thermostat and a camera yeah, and awesome. some sensors. Very, very awesome. And it integrates with all sorts of other stuff if you already have it in your home. Yep. Yes. Thank you guys so much. I'm not sure if I remember your names correctly. Let me see if I get it right. Joe and Joe. So Joe 1 and Joe 2. Excellent. That's us. These are the Insteon guys. Yes. Insteon. If you're not with Insteon, you're missing the boat. You've got to get with Insteon. I mean, think about it. Right now, you could be changing the thermostat at work in your house. Your house could be air conditioned when you get home or heated when you get home without wasting that energy all day. You could make sure the TV's off. You could make sure your kids are safe you got to get with Insteon. It's reasonable, it's affordable, and it's easy to use. You saw it. We'll be back with a whole lot more from CES Live right after this. I'm Michael Arches. Don't go anywhere. You're watching Beat Terrific's continuing coverage of CES Live 2015 from the Sands Expo Center in Las Vegas, Nevada.